All right, we'll start Revelation tomorrow as um, we're just syncing up the columns. We'll be on column one in both books. Obviously, when I open the Bible, it's two columns on one page, two on the other, and I like them to be on the same column as I'm switching from Daniel to Revelation study now. We always go back and forth, don't we? All right, so, yep, that was that. And this is this. Albeit there came other boats from Tiberias nigh unto the place where they did eat bread. After that, Jesus had given thanks. When the people therefore saw that Jesus was not there, neither his disciples, they took shipping and came to Capernaum seeking for Jesus. And when they had found him on the other side of the sea, they said unto him, Rabbi, when camest thou hither? Jesus answered and said to them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, ye seek me. Not because ye saw the miracles, but because you did eat of the loaves and were filled. Labor not for the food which will perish, but for the real food which endureth unto everlasting life, which the Son of Man shall give unto you, for him hath God the Father sealed. So that's interesting. God the Father sealed. And of course, they call food meat. I just sort of translated that over for us. Um, for him hath God the Father sealed. Let me see how that's worded here. Perishable things like food. Spend your energy seeking the eternal life that the Son of Man can give you, for God the Father has given me the seal of his approval. Okay. Then said they unto him, What shall we do that we might work the works of God? Jesus answered and said unto them, This is the work of God, that ye believe on him who have sent me. Excuse me. That you believe on him whom he have sent. In other words, Jesus. Now that's instruction. That doesn't mean you have free will. That's the parable of the word of God. That as it's giving instruction, it seems like you have free will to do so. And of course, we know what believing really is, what faith really is. It's the tangible evidence of your salvation. It's the actual evidence of the Holy Spirit. So since this is such a short study, we'll go to Hebrews 11.1. Now, faith is the, what's the substance, tangible evidence. And what is your hope? It's your salvation. It's the evidence of your salvation, comma. It's the evidence of the Holy Spirit. It's the evidence of things not seen. What's not seen? John 3, 8. The Holy Spirit. It's like the wind. And how do you get your faith? So faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the word of God. We know that the word of God is Jesus, John 1.1. 1, 1. Jesus said, my sheep hear my voice, uh, which is John 10, uh, 26 and 27. John the Baptist said, one will come after me that will baptize with the Holy Spirit and fire. So that's your baptism by the Holy Spirit. When you get the call from Jesus, and didn't God say, I will put my law in their inward heart parts and write it on their hearts, and I will be their God, and they will be my people? Sure did. All right, love you very much. Ask questions anytime. That's what I'm here for.